My name is Lotta. Um, I'm Belgian of origin. I studied here between 2002 and 2006. I did the Arts and Culture Bachelor and the ESST Master Program, um, the European Program on Science, Society and Technology. Long title. Yeah. So what, uh, within the Arts and Culture Program, what uh, specialisation did you do and, and what perhaps did you write your thesis about, if that related to, to what you did next? I did various specialisations, so I didn't actually specialise. Um, one fond memory is that I have is the interfaculty minor of uh, in globalisation and inequality. Uh, okay. um, I think I did a technology uh, specialisation, one in media and one in the arts, so very widespread. Yeah, I think it was finally in my master program that I actually specialised a little. I wrote my thesis on how to measure globalisation, mm -hmm. which was a really interesting thing to do because I, I did it as a kind of thesis internship with the ISIS centre. Mm -hmm. um, it's one of the reasons I stayed here in Maastricht during my masters also because I had a very focused idea of who I wanted as my mentor for my thesis, um, so I decided to stay. Um, and it was a very rewarding thesis process because mm. not many researchers had actually written about it. Mm. So they sort of took my thesis into a book that they published mm. later, so that was nice. Okay. And were there any specific skills or, or things you learnt, you think, within arts and culture that really related to your master and really helped you with that? combination of PBL and arts and culture is, is a very good combination because of the complexity of the subject matter. Um, it's a good way of, of tackling that. So then since your master, what have you done since then and what are you doing now? The most interesting job that I do is the job I do right now and that I'm really happy with. It's also the first job where they explicitly um, appreciated the fact that I studied in Maastricht mm -hmm. uh, during my um, application interview. I referred back to the PBL system and the content of my studies and they were really enthusiastic about it. I'm speaking of Belgium where they're usually pretty conservative and mm -hmm. the education system is also pretty conservative and they were really happy to have someone with who, who actually had a degree that has some skills with it yeah. and also they were looking for someone who could um, exactly what we do in arts and culture who could really approach complex subject matters and look at it from different perspectives and choose strategically um, which perspective would be most useful, yeah. uh, what kind of conclusions you could get from that. So uh, you can really see a direct correlation between your studies in Maastricht and what you're doing now? Yes, actually I rely back on it every single day during my job. Um, so I feel really fulfilled actually having done these studies and mm. doing what I do now. The organisation I work for is called Bioforum and they uh, represent organic agriculture uh, in Flanders. Um, also on the European level we have some representations and inside this organization um, I do the communication and marketing strategy which is really interesting because it's a combination of creativity which has always been my second love, mm -hmm. painting and illustrations and everything um, and my arts and culture background which is the content, the complexity of the subject matter. I really love my job and I really love the fact that I have this in my luggage case, Arts and Culture and ESST, to be a good employee every day and to make a living. It's very nice. Yeah. Excellent. Thank you very much.